And there's a metalworks place over here I've never been into. So I'm gonna go ask that lady if I can come in and take a look. I'm Dean Kerfman. We're the owner of Oak Hill Iron Plus Wood. Uh, you're in our gallery in 107 South Sterling, South King Street, excuse me. In Morganton. In Morganton, North Carolina. How long have you been here? We've only been here about three months. Two months. Uh, yeah, two I, I, now, months. I've been driving by, seeing it and everything. So look at all this crazy wood around here. Tell, what is all this that I'm seeing here, all this, this all product? All this wood is wood that, that is brung in by tree, tree arborist or they, they either take it down because of disease, they either take it down because of construction, falls on a house, yeah. and we buy the logs off of the, off of the tree trimmers and the arborists, and then we slab them, we air dry them, we kiln dry them, we sterilize them, and then we flatten our slabs. So when you come to a slab, whether you want a coffee table, you want a dinette table, sofa table, you want uh, countertops, whatever you need wood for, Basically, you sand them and they're ready to go. And you've got crazy amounts. So you, I see, I've seen all kinds of wood here too, uh, right? It's not all just the native woods that, that, you know, whatever they bring us, you know, red, white oak, there's sycamore, there's maple, there's cottonwood, uh, there's walnut, and There's more of it back over there. And, and they're, they're everywhere. So let, let me, let's look at some of the finished things that you make out of these. Okay, oh, hang on. these three that you see in front of us here, this is spalted maple, kind of a rarity in our field. Uh, nature has, all the design you see here is done by nature. It's sort of hit or miss. It's one step, and if we don't catch it in time, it is totally gone, it's too far. This is happened to be a chain, an anchor, an antique anchor chain. Don't work out from it. It's been around a long, long time. It's got a five inch thick maple top on it. Uh, here's a display of a lot of different woods, what they look like finished. Red oak at the bottom, white oak, cherry, white oak, maple, and red oak. It's kind of a collage of different things. Here's a postmodern chair built out of slabs. These are samples of textures, finishes, different elements. Uh, for you to touch and feel is, is what this this wall here is. Uh, copper finishes, steel finishes, how we upset different legs, you know, different finishes. Different so are these all things you've made? These are like old examples. This is what these looks are like. samples of, of things that we've made through the years or whatever. Uh, you know, different. These are just different attachments. All these rings show different elements of what we can do with steel, what finial hands look like, you know, what handles can be done. All this is, is, is that's what we do here. And I'm sure you made that big door behind you there. That, <laughs> look at that thing. Awesome. We've been so busy at the shop, I haven't put handles on them yet. We, so I, I must put handles on them. That is crazy. That's very cool. That yeah. bench is crazy cool. What a lot of people call this the boat bench, you know, or the library bench. Yeah. It's, it's our version of, he's going to sit on a bunch of books. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so. And some of it is just, I mean, it's all kind of like pure art, but that piece on the wall back there just looks this, like a piece of art. This is an art piece, and it is for sale. Uh, and it is white oak, and it's been blackened too, and it's some of the, some of the, White run back there, and then it's got a finished branch on that iron. How did you learn to work with iron? Uh, I've been doing it for 30 years, and I've actually traveled the entire world studying every year for 15 years, and I would go somewhere to study under somebody. So I am curious. I grew up in a place called Spruce Pine, yes. Little Switzerland. There's a guy named B. Hensley. B. Hensley. Do you know who B was? I know B very well. Now he's he's dead now, right? He's dead. And he's Mike is still alive, though. Is, still alive. is he still doing it? Mike's in his seventies. Is he really? And uh, but B actually come to my shop here before he died. Really? He's never done that. B was a B was an artist too. I mean, yes. it's, it's what you're doing here looks. I mean, yours is way different. All these designs over here are really B cool. He was very traditional. Yeah, he was. My dad. That is really nice hanging on the wall over there too. I like that one on top. I like all of these. We actually done that one. That went to Indiana into a doctor's house up there. His theme of wildlife. 
Wow. Uh, the sculpture there was done by one of the artists that worked for us, uh, Francisco. He's done half a dozen art sculptures in here. This is Liam. This is Liam, okay. This is my partner. So, uh, you got a website. What is your website? Kill Iron Plus Wood. Come and see us. You know, we're open. We're open 10 to 4, Monday through Friday. I mean, excuse me. 10 to 6, Monday through Friday, 10 to 4 on Saturday. Awesome. Um, Shay is our manager. She's here all the time. Lynn and I is here, but if we're not, we're not here, we're at the show. Excellent. Thank you.